Yo, y'all know who it be. Good Doc, Dr. Mike TV driving again. I know this should be hella reckless and hella dangerous, but I'm gonna be a little bit more safer about it. Gotta put my seatbelt on, I'll get to it in a minute, but Doc gotta get this one out the way. Gotta ask a quick question to my audience, ladies and gentlemen, because I feel like I am personally under attack. <laughs> Not really. But I do have to ask the question though. I really want to understand the psyche. I want to understand the mindset. A mindset as a man. Mentality. Is compromising in a relationship considered to be simpish? Earlier today I posted a video. I was like, you know, I don't mind having compromised and let my young lady make some decisions every now and again. But I don't want anybody to be under the assumption that I'm letting my young lady run my life in any way shape or form or that you should let your young lady run your life you know you should be able to you know establish that stronghold and you know put your foot down and be who you need to be don't ever compromise on that but just because I feel like it's okay for the young lady to make some decisions I kind of feel like that little bit of compromising or that little bit of uh leeway in some instances I kind of feel like it might come off to others as simpish. And I guess I'm just asking the questions. This isn't really a retaliation or uh, me being upset or anything. It's just really the question that I'm asking. Is compromising considered simpish or weak in any way, shape, or form? I personally don't mind letting a young lady do some things because a lot of the times I don't want to do every damn thing. You know, if, if she wanted to say, oh, babe, can we go watch this movie today? Okay, whatever. If it make her feel happy, okay, fuck it. We'll watch a movie. We'll watch the movie she wants to watch this time. That's what I mean by making some decisions. I'm not talking about anything detrimental to the relationship, like uh, making financial decisions and stuff like that. Nothing that you are entitled to. Nothing that as long as you're bringing the majority of the money in the relationship, 99.9% .9 of the time you are, she should not have any type of... Um, say so in that particular instance of the relationship but some minor stuff is all I'm talking about in reference to the idea of giving her some leeway and making some decisions okay where you want to eat at okay what you what do you feel like cooking for dinner tonight or something I don't know but I guess my whole question and line of questioning in this particular aspect of realm I'm trying to uh get through is you know is compromising considered simpish nowadays I guess I'm confused. I feel like a lot of people like to believe that, you know, compromising comes off as simpish. Mm. Okay. <laughs> it's been a good Doc, Dr. Mike TV. I'm not trying to waste too much time on here. Just asking a question. I'm driving. This shit is hella unsafe. I should probably go ahead and stop doing this. <laughs> not too many more of these videos coming. Actually, there's a lot more of these videos coming. Got a couple of pre-records. I can't help already, so they got to come out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all take care and God bless. And make sure you leave down in the comment section below, do you believe compromising is considered simpish in 2020, ladies and gentlemen? Doc is out. Peace.